play better. We got to play better. We got to take care of the ball. We got to um, get the ball moving a little better. We got to rebound the ball. Some things that's very correctable, the small things that we got to do. But a lot of small things in this league, if you don't do it, um, creates major problems. And our first two games, uh, both games were one games for us. We just didn't win. We just didn't win. And when I asked the guys after the game, I said, you know, Y'all tell me why we didn't win these two, last two games. And they explain why we didn't win, though. Know, we, we didn't share the ball like we were sharing the ball the whole four or five days of training camp. Uh, we wasn't rebounding the ball. And just our communication was lacking. But all these things are correct things that we went through. Who are you looking for to adjust the most going into tomorrow night's game? Well, I want our veteran guys. I want Chris to invest. You know, I want them guys. The pressure's on them. They have to play better. They have to play better. You got your veteran guys. They're supposed to play better, and we expect them to play better for us to win games. And playing better is not about scoring points. It ain't about scoring points. It's the, it's the extra things to do, the loose balls. You know, we have yet to win a 50-50 ball game yet. And we win 50-50 ball games in this, this kind of tournament. We win basketball games. So we continue to lose that, that ball game, that, that that part of the ball game, we'll lose games. Sam, what have you seen out of Vess at the center position? Is that trying to toughen tough him up? Yeah, we gotta toughen him up. We got it. You know, he gonna have to play against some stronger guys in, in the East or the power four power four position. But hey, it is what it is, you know. As long as you're on the court, that's the biggest thing you gotta worry about. You're on the court and play. Way to get his confidence up going in because a lot of we got to find minutes. We got to find minutes for him. We're trying to find minutes for him. So, center position in this kind of league right here, there's not too many dominant post players in this league right here. And, um, best league can play the four to five. You know, and he's, I think he's been solid, you know, but I'm expecting more. So, winning is actually important for you to get a win. Yeah, uh, if I play the game and not to win, <laughs> I don't know, me personally, I don't know no way but to win. You know, and winning is, is you know, it's hard to win. It's hard to win in this league, in any league, I think. But um, we got to do more. We have to do more. But you guys had seemed like you had two different personalities in the first two games. You played better defensively in the first one, and offensively, uh, uh -huh. it was one game you played good defense. Yeah. Next game. So now, played, this, hopefully, this next game tomorrow night, we put it all together. We put the offense together, and the defense yeah. together, <laughs> and put it together. Is, is Vesely having trouble in terms? It seems like is it transition defense an issue for him, a bigger? Issue for him, anything in particular more so? It seems like his offense is getting a little bit better. His offense is getting a little bit better, but unfortunately, you got to play both ends of the court. And uh, he got to make the adjustments. He ain't playing bad, but being his third third year, he got to play better. I, I'm expecting a little bit more. Do you think it's a case of everyone trying to do too much out there right now? That's seems the whole like summer league. It's, it's a showcase. It's a showcase. So everybody's trying to show the GMs and the coaches that they can do more. You no, know? but that's, you know, but as a professional, you got to, you know, calm yourself down and say, okay, let me play within the team or unit and help this team win. Well, right, do you think you're going to play more of Glenn and Otto together uh, these next, you know, few games? I know they've kind of played separately a lot, you know, the first two games. Oh, we, we'll, we'll see about that. Mm -hmm. We'll see. Yeah, they played a little bit together the other day, but we'll see, you know, get them on the court, you know. Yeah. I'm trying to find the best spot possible, you know, to win a game for me. With, with Chris, I mean, what what exactly would you say is like kind of his ideal offensive role game, you know, out here? What do you want, really want to see with him? I just want Chris to make quick decisions. You know, pick and roll, he catch it, he shoot it, yeah. he drive it. You know, I don't want him, you know, pump fakes and indecisiveness. Um, you know, you can't be a good basketball player being indecisive. If you can do it, you're not going to do it, you know? And once he understands that part, I think this will be okay. Any of the guys who are free agents on this roster are going to make, you think, can make any sort of impact in terms of helping you in, in particular? Well, I like the kid, Haynes. Haynes on our team. He, he's he, it's my cast, my keys, my <laughs> he's, he, he He's pretty good, man. He's pretty good, you know. You know he's, he hasn't hurt himself at all. He hasn't hurt, hurt himself at all as far as um, the summer league. And, um, I think a lot of people has been inquiring about them, different teams, so more power to them. Well, ZCB does it on both ends, and it's not just that he's a good shooter. It seems, like you, it seems like you guys just run much more smoother offensively when he's... No doubt about it. I think, you know, some some guys get it, some guys don't get it, you know? But we only have four days of practice, so asking these guys to be, you know, sharp, you know, it's kind of difficult. 
But no, I think he's he, he, he fine. He's fine. What do you say to people trying to glean too much from Otto Porter's performances so so far? When, especially when you're trying to experiment a lot with them. Yeah, I'm. I'm tomorrow I might play him at the point or something. No, he, I'm telling you, I'm just, we want to see. We want to see what he can do. We want to see what he brings to our ball club. You know, I try him at the power forward a little bit. I might play him at the power forwards. We got to see what he can do, what he can't do. How do you balance that with also kind of giving him some opportunities to get some confidence? I mean, how do you balance you know, experimenting with him but also not well, over-experimenting? He's, well, well, he's never over-experimenting okay. in some league. He's trying to find the things he do well and the things he don't do. And he's fine, you know. He, we know one thing, he can get the shots up. You know, he, you know yeah. we know that. But long as a player can get the shots off, you know, he'll make some, you know, he's just, it's all new to him.